Welcome to Grizzly Youth Academy's virtual orientation. Let's get started. Our mission. The mission of Grizzly Youth Challenge Academy is to intervene in and reclaim the lives of 15 and a half to 18 year old at risk youth. To produce program graduates that will leave the program with values, life skills, education, and the self-discipline necessary to succeed as productive citizens. Our goal is to take the student out of their traditional environment, remove any negative influences and distractions in order to provide them a healthy reset to become the best version of themselves. Grizzly is not a boot camp. Grizzly Youth Academy is a charter high school located on a National Guard base in San Luis Obispo. Our academy mirrors military customs and courtesies, discipline, and leadership. Rehab facility. It is strongly encouraged that if a student uses any substances, they allow their body to detox prior to attending our academy. We are not a certified rehab facility and cannot offer services those facilities provide. The environment at Grizzly is a controlled high stress environment. While we offer a variety of different counseling groups and life coping classes, we are not a therapeutic or mental health facility. Because we are a volunteer program, students cannot be court appointed to attend our program. We are not a juvenile facility. Applicants must meet all eligibility requirements to be considered. The student must be 15 and a half to 18 years of age by the first day. The student cannot be younger than 15 and a half or turn 19 before the class start date. The student must be a U.S. citizen or legal resident of California. A copy of the student's birth certificate will be required upon application submission. A social security card or TIN must be provided if a student was born outside of the United States. Students must be credit deficient. Because we are a credit recovery charter high school, students must be behind in credits, including those who are currently failing any classes. Students must be physically and mentally capable of completing the program. Our academy focuses heavily on becoming healthy, both physically and mentally. A student must be cleared by a medical provider to engage in physical activities. Please note, we meet students where they are at and will work with them to improve their health and wellness so long as they are willing to put in the effort. Students cannot have felonies on their record. Students with felonies are pending a felony will not be considered. However, students with a misdemeanor charge or lower as well as those on probation can still apply. Please note legal documentation will be required. Students must be willing to become drug free. Students must apply on their own terms. This is a 100% voluntary program and the change only works if the student is willing to put in the effort. These are our eight core components. These are all components the students will have to pass in order to graduate our program. Academic excellence. On average, students increase their reading and compre comprehension skills by two grade levels. Life coping skills. All students will attend life coping skills, anger management, and conflict resolution classes. Leadership and followership. All students will rotate leadership and followership roles to develop time management, teamwork, and communication skills. Students placed in these roles will be leading groups ranging from 5 to 10 students to the whole platoon, which could be around 55 students. Responsible citizenship. If a student is 18 years or older, they can register to vote. Service to community. A minimum of 40 hours of service to community will be completed by each student. Health and hygiene. Students will be provided with three balanced meals per day and will undergo health and hygiene courses. Physical fitness. Physical fitness will be conducted every day. While there are no organized sports, students will have the opportunity to play sports amongst each other. Last but not least, job skills. Each student will develop job skills, including how to create a resume, participate in mock job interviews, 
and learn to dress for success. Grizzly Challenge Charter High School. Our high school is a traditional high school setting with civilian teachers. However, military staff will continue to maintain supervision. Students will earn up to 60 credits, which is equivalent to one year's worth of high school credits in five and a half months. All students will receive their food handler certificate and have the opportunity to complete driver's ed online. Our graduation requirement is 200 credits. Students who are eligible can receive their high school diploma, test out of high school with the high set or chess B, or continue on with Grizzly Youth Academy's independent studies program. Our high school provides college tours, educational field trips, and career fairs for the academy. We also offer club activities such as student council, college club, and yearbook. Each platoon will have its own case manager. The assigned case manager will be in charge of communicating with the student and the mentor throughout the entire program. During the residential portion, the student will create a map, a My Action Plan. This is your roadmap to success. The My Action Plan consists of the student planning out their goals. They will plan out their short-term goals, which are goals they achieve during the five and a half months at Grizzly. They will also create long-term goals to achieve once they graduate Grizzly and transition back home. The map will be focused on how to continue being successful after Grizzly. Our academy is broken down into three phases. We will further go into those phases in the next few slides. Our first phase is the acclimation phase. This is the first two weeks of students being away from home and adjusting to life here at Grizzly. During these two weeks, they are in a controlled stress environment where we are able to identify students' willingness and ability to succeed in the program. Candidates are learning how to address staff, what the daily routine will look like. They will be going through a variety of different team building courses and exercises and meeting with their peers. They will be acclimating to what Grizzly is and what it will be moving forward. Students will be considered candidates throughout this two week acclimation phase. Upon completion, they will earn the title of cadet. Phase two, residential phase. Upon graduating the acclimation phase, students will move into the residential phase. This is the 20 week residential portion of our program. At this point in time, they will have earned the title of cadet and are now able to wear the Grizzly uniform. During this phase, students will begin going to school Monday through Friday to include educational field trips. They will develop positive habits with the help of staff and resources. They will build confidence, leadership skills and identify career interests. On weekends, students will conduct service to the community, maintain area cleanliness, and attend academy social events, including movie nights, hikes, beach days, and off-post field trips. Throughout the five and a half months, students' main form of communication will be letter writing. On Sundays, students will make five-minute supervised phone calls to family and mentors. These phone calls will alternate between the family and mentor. Families and mentors will have the opportunity to visit their cadet at the academy during events such as Family Day and Mentor Day. During the five and a half months, there will be two home passes where students will be able to visit their home for three to five days each visit. All details will be provided to either the family or mentor in advance. Know your why to get through challenge. Students may face challenges during their stay at Grizzly. 
and it's important for students to know and remember their why. Their why are all the reasons they want to make the change. Some challenges include no TV, video games, or social media. That is not to say you may not have an opportunity throughout the cycle. However, all privileges here at Grizzly are earned. We will provide training on the importance of responsible technology and social media use. Some more challenges include being away from home, family, and friends. Stepping out of your comfort zone into a new environment, away from negative influences and distractions to be able to work and focus on you. Living in a dorm room setting. Students will live in a dorm room setting. The virtual tour of our academy will walk through our barracks where students will sleep. Males will cut their hair to a one and females will slick their hair back in a sock bun in accordance with military standard. There are no individuals here at Grizzly. The standard is the same for all cadets. We are one team, one fight mentality. Each student will put in the work mentally, physically, and push their limits to reach their ultimate goals. Once our students are on grounds, there is no quitting. Students made a voluntary commitment to themselves and the program. We will not quit on them, nor will we allow them to quit on themselves. We will continue to hold them to that commitment, support and encourage these students if any challenges arise. Mentors make a difference. It is mandatory for every student to find their own mentor. A mentor is someone the student sees as a good role model and will support the students throughout the cycle by five minute phone calls and letter writing. Mentors will be required to attend one training day here at Grizzly and pass a background check. Eligibility requirements for mentors are, they must be 25 years of age or older, they must be the same gender as, as the cadet. A few examples of who mentors can be are an aunt, uncle, godparent, family, family friend, coach, or school staff. They cannot be an immediate family member or live in the same household. Mentors must agree to support the student for one year after graduating the residential phase by submitting one report monthly, which we'll discuss more in detail in the next few slides. Our Academy is free of charge, equivalent to a $22,000 scholarship. Grizzly Youth Challenge Academy is ran by National Guard. We are 75% federally funded and 25% state funded. We provide all room and board costs, all education costs, all uniforms, and all meals. The only items the family must provide are basic necessities such as toothpaste and laundry detergent, writing equipment such as envelopes and stamps, running shoes, medical coverage if doctor visits are necessary, and medical insurance is required. Once the student is accepted, the packing list will be sent out. Please do not begin acquiring these items until instructed to do so. TAC. This is our Transition Acclimation Day, also known as TAC. This is a mandatory event for accepted applicants and one parent or guardian. Throughout this event, students will prove motivation and commitment. They will show ability to cope with structure and stress and complete the registration process. Think of TAC as a Grizzly tryout and give it your all. You may only attend if you are invited. In summary, Grizzly can offer each student a healthy environment to learn and grow away from negative influences and distractions, safety and security, three catered meals each day and two snacks, one year worth of high school credits in half the amount of time, career and educational planning and development, future college scholarship opportunities, the ability to make yourself 
and people you care about proud. Create long-lasting meaningful friendships, mentally, emotionally, and physically healthier. If any of these sound beneficial to you, the student, Grizzly Youth Academy may be the perfect place for you to become the best version of yourself. The final phase is our post-residential phase. This is one year long. Students have graduated the residential portion of the program and will maintain contact with their mentor and or assigned case manager. The post-residential phase begins immediately upon graduating the residential portion. The purpose of this phase is to continue supporting the students once they transition back home. Our staff is verifying that, verifying that the graduate is positively placed. They must be employed, attending school, and or volunteering to maintain positive placement. Their assigned case manager will continue to be their point of contact and also wants to ensure that the student has all the resources they may need to be successful. Next, we will be giving you a virtual walkthrough of Grizzly Youth Academy.
Here are the following steps to apply for Grizzly. You are currently leading step one by completing this virtual orientation. Step two, after completing this orientation, you will confirm your attendance below and be redirected to the digital application. This application link will also be sent to you by email. We strongly encourage beginning the application as soon as possible, as you will need to obtain documents such as your school transcripts, vaccination record, sports physical, and other supporting items. Step three, upon completing the application, a Grizzly staff member will reach out to the student to conduct a one-on-one -on -one interview. After the interview, your application will go through a departmental review process. Step four, if your application is selected, you will be invited to TAC Day. As previously mentioned, TAC is a mandatory event for all tentatively accepted students. Last but not least, accept the challenge. Upon acceptance, Class 51 will start July 15, 2023. The student, family, and mentor will begin their journey towards change. Parents will commit to parenting classes, mentors will commit to their mentor duties, and the candidate will commit to reach their full potential. Please note that throughout the application process, our main form of communication is email. Make sure to keep us informed if there are any changes in your contact information. Are you ready to become the best version of yourself and accept the challenge? If you'd like to learn and see more of what Grizzly has to offer, please follow us on social media at Grizzly Youth Academy. Thank you for attending our virtual orientation. We hope to hear from you soon.